Hello and welcome my eight path leaves. So today we are here to unbox the Octopath Traveler 2 Collector's Edition, which probably has some kind of name, but I don't know. So it comes in a very big cupboard box. So that is the game. I am just kidding, of course. There is the game separate to an extra box, which has the collector's edition in it. Away with that. Getting closer to the camera. And let's get into this. I hope this was seeable in the camera, because if I hold it in front of my face, I can't see the camera. So let's dig in. Hopefully this opens up nicely. Ah yeah, this looks good. This is some nice quality plastic, which is a weird thing to say, but like, it feels so smooth. And there we have it. It is a collector's edition. I, uh, the light is reflecting it. Ah, there it goes. This goes. I think it's a pretty good one, though. Thinking about the first one's collector's edition with the pop-up book, it probably can't compare to that, but that doesn't mean it's bad, right? It would still be a good thing. It, it could. No, it would. Opens up like this, okay. Uh, yeah, get my microphone back, maybe. And we start with the hard to get out. Come on, here. Get up. Why do you. With the soundtrack, which uh, has these things on the side, and I can't get it out. Well, what a good start. I hope there's nothing underneath that. Mm. Doesn't seem like it. So, I just hand this to my wife to free it. Free it! Make it free! And we have the meat and bones of the collector's edition right here, which I put to the side. And first, we won't look inside because of spoilers, but this is the art album, as it is called. Which is probably an art book. And, oh, the back side. Oh, you can even see it! I was just about to say you can't see the coolest thing even, like the reflecting stuff, which is rainbowy, but you can! Wow, the camera picks that up. Oh. Hello, me. Yeah, you can see me recording. <laughs> I didn't realize. Oh, well. That is not a problem. So, ah, you got the soundtrack out. It is freed, and here it is. Looks the same as in the the holding cupboard stuff. So, but the meat and bones we have here. These figurines, which are really badly visible if in packaging. So, let's put this on the side. I think I keep that broken chair there. It kind of comes in handy. Uh, yeah, well, and that, of course, needs my cutting tool to open up. Good thing I have that handy all the time with me. Also helps if while grocery shopping somebody is annoying. I don't take it with me when grocery shopping. I don't do that was a joke. Bad one, good one, that's for you to decide. But we have a map inside, which is cool in and of itself. However, and this is what sold it to me, because this is just so cool and also taped up again. So much tape. So much tape. Which... Do we really need that tape on this? I wonder. Like, it's in that box and stuff. Isn't it secure enough? Oh well. Opens up and gives us these... Uh, what do you call them? Busts of the main characters. Made out of, as you can see, yeah, plastic, it's not metal. Like, I think it would have been more expensive if they were actual metal, but these look really good. I don't know the names of the characters yet. I didn't really look up much of the game. I played the demo and stuff, but when it comes to RPGs like this, I just buy them and want to go in as blind as possible, so 
didn't watch anything except the reveal trailer. So don't mind me. Uh, there we have old guy, Mac Beard. I swear I can create better names. <laughs> then we have. Wait, didn't we have this character before? Like actually, I think they look don't look that uh, that similar if you see them in color. But yeah. Then, come on, get out of here. I think this is some kind of mage, probably. Looks like it, with a cape and stuff. And we have, okay. I know this is pretty normal for busts, but I like this character, but somehow, the way the arms are cut off, that looks a tad bit weird, actually. Huh. Oh well. Still looks good, but like, hmm. Oh, I have played her in the demo. Like, uh, not as my main, but I got to a second character and it was her. She's the app Girl dealing with herbs and stuff. Apothecary. That's the name. And, yeah, that was definitely my favorite. Uh, this one I chose as my first character to play in the demo and honestly I chose by rolling a dice and got the one I was most interested in so lucky for me and That's actually already it. This is the Octopath Traveler 2 Collector's Edition. So what are your thoughts on it? Do you have the game as well? What do you think about the game? What did you think about the first game? Tell me all that in the comments below as you do I'm eager to see those comments. Also, choose your path by clicking on like, subscribe and the bell to keep updated whenever I upload a new video. Also, follow me in the links below on Twitter and Instagram as well as joining my Discord. I keep you updated there, post stuff, you know what to do on there. As well as my merch store and my Twitch where I live from every Friday, Saturday, Sunday and Monday. I hope to see you over there as well, and until next time, bye me!